In the world of shopping and retail, the e-commerce business has become a significant front runner. Pretty much anything that you need or want, you can find with a simple Google search and a few clicks, and in a few days, it'll be in your front door. Now, funny enough, as profitable and as huge as the industry is, it's actually one of the lower cost businesses that you're able to start up. Since we are in the dropshipping business, we don't have to worry about storing inventory or shipping anything. We have our suppliers to do that for us. We are pretty much the middlemen. So since we don't have to worry about the time consuming and labor intensive process of purchasing all of our items and shipping them, we can focus all our time and effort into finding the winning products that we're gonna be selling. Now that in itself can be a fairly time consuming process. You need to find out what's trending, what products are popular, and not everything sells all of the time. Now you know that we here at AutoDS got your back and we're here to help you succeed. So in this video we're going to be talking about the 14 best niches for your dropshipping business. Now before we get started let me quickly explain what a niche is. It's pretty much just a specialized segment of a market. So it could be shoes and apparel or jewelry and watches, sports and fitness, things like that. It's really what you would call the entire category. So in itself, really drop shipping is a niche and underneath that there's a bunch of different niches. Now having an entire catalog of similar or niched items actually has potential for huge profit because there's already demand in the market for these particular items. You just have to target that demographic. Before we get started, my name is Mario with AutoDS, and if you like videos on the dropshipping niche, then make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future content. Remember that we're here to help you grow and scale your business, so you don't wanna miss out. Make sure to hit that subscribe. Now, starting off our countdown in at number one, we have the health and beauty care business. This is a booming industry that is not slowing down. It's projected to hit over 600 billion dollars by the end of 2023. Now one of the awesome things about this particular niche is the fact that it's so big that there's a never-ending supply of products. The variations are endless. Now that being said, a lot of these products also work together. So you have a huge potential to be able to upsell or sell things in bundles. And I'm talking about this from experience because let me tell you that when my wife purchases a makeup brush, she doesn't just buy one brush, she buys an entire set. So potential for upselling is there. Now some of the more trending products in this market are facial beauty rollers, makeup brush sets, anti-snoring mouthpieces, neck massagers, hair clippers, lash lifting sets. There's a ton of different products. If you want a longer list of products to offer either in this niche or any of the other niches that I'm gonna list, make sure to check out the description down below. The link to the article will be there. Coming in at number two, we have men's fashion. The fashion industry is usually tailored towards women, which makes the men's fashion niche a lot less saturated and gives us a lot more potential for profit. Now, fashion is always gonna be in demand. The only thing about this niche is that you have to keep up with the trends, otherwise you're gonna stay behind. Now some of the best selling products in this category are slim fit trousers, 3D printed all over shirts, which if you don't know what that is, it's pretty much just a t-shirt that's printed all over. The whole thing is printed, there's no blank spots on it. Cycling jersey sets, which I've actually seen a lot. A lot of the times when I'm out driving, I see somebody in their bicycle, they always have a full set on. They have the matching shirt and shorts. Another thing is corduroy shirts and cargo pants. Now those two are actually my favorite. Also remember that a lot of these things have to do based around the seasons. So a lot of times you're not really gonna be selling sweatpants during the summer or shorts during the winter. So just keep that in mind for when you're listing your items. Up next on number three, we have women's fashion. Now, just like men's fashion, it never goes out of style. It's always gonna be in demand. Now in the women's fashion industry, there's a lot and I mean a lot of variation. Fashion is a personal expression of style, which means there's always something for everyone and that makes this business extremely lucrative. Now, as I did state before, in the women's fashion industry, there is a lot of competition, so just make sure to keep up with the trends. Now, one of the more highly suggested products that I think you should add to your store are the legging and sports bra yoga sets. Those are extremely popular. You see those everywhere. Personally, living in South Florida, if I go to the mall, I'm going to see at least 10 or 15 people wearing the same exact yoga set. So trust me when I say this is a very hot item and you want to have this in your store. Another thing to check out are the thin puffer jackets. These are extremely popular, especially during the winter and even more in the states that it snows. Furnishing our number four spot, we have furniture and home decor. Ever since the pandemic, more people than ever have been spending time at home. And that's mainly because they're also working from home. As a result of that, Everyone wants to make their house or their little space that they're working in or wherever they're staying at, they want to spruce it up, make it a bit more personal, make it more them. Which in turn, the demand for furniture, home furnishings, home office equipment has skyrocketed. One of the really good things about this niche is the fact that you have high ticket items. High ticket items means you can sell them for a higher profit. Some of the more profitable products in this niche can include side tables, rugs, 
LED candles, artificial plants, the list goes on. And once again, if you want a more detailed list of products for any of these niches, check out the description below. The link to the article will be there. Now coming into our number five spot, we have jewelry and watches. Jewelry and watches go hand in hand with fashion. And for one, they're never gonna go out of style. Absolutely everyone loves a piece of jewelry. Everyone loves a watch. Any occasion that comes up, if whether it's a birthday, Valentine's, Christmas, jewelry and watches are always gonna be an extremely popular gift. Another good thing about these items is that you have a ton of different variations whether it be low ticket items or high ticket items. They can start off with maybe 10 or $15 and go up to the hundreds or thousands. Now, when it comes to jewelry and watches, you do wanna make sure that you target the right demographic of people. A lot of people have different budgets when it comes to these kinds of things. So you don't wanna be offering somebody that has a lower budget, a higher ticket item or vice versa. One way to combat that is just have a bunch of different variations, have lower priced and higher priced items. A few of the items that you do wanna offer in your store though, can include the ever popular golden chain. Everyone loves the golden chains, silver ring sets. People People love rings and when it comes to silver rings they tend to be on the lower ticket side you also have things like the heart and letter necklaces where you just have the little heart or somebody's initials on there smart watches fitness watches iced out watches just full of diamonds the possibilities for this are endless and trust me somebody's gonna like what you have to offer just have a bunch of different variations on there and you'll be good quick tip always try to offer handmade jewelry when it comes to handmade jewelry people absolutely love it they love the uniqueness of it and the fact that it was made by somebody by hand people typically tend to spend a little bit more on custom and unique pieces of jewelry now in at number six we have office supplies office supplies are used all the time office supplies tend to have a lot of consumables like paper ink pens which are always running out and always being replaced. There's also a very broad demographic of people when it comes to this niche because everyone has their preferences when it comes to type of paper, type of pens, brand of paper, or maybe brand of folders that they use. There's a lot of things and a lot of times people tend to associate their brand or their business with a particular brand that they're using. So let's say in my business, I could use a particular set of pens just because I like how they write. Now, once again, the number of items that you can offer for this are endless, but some of the things that you wanna make sure that you have in your store are always going to be electric pencil sharpeners, paper, staples, staple holders, notepads, desk organizers. There's a lot of different things that you can offer. Just make sure to offer a nice variety of them so that way you can have something for everyone. Now coming to our number seven spot, we have home improvement tools. Ever since the pandemic, there's been a huge boom in the DIY industry. Everyone loves to spruce up and put their own take on their house or their personal space. Everyone wants to be able to do it themselves and be able to fix it themselves which in turn can make it a more cost-effective option than selling office furniture because instead of selling the furniture, we're selling the tools to fix that furniture. Now there's a lot of different items that you can offer in this niche. Some of them being things like mop and broom holders, you know, like the ones that you can stick on the wall so that way you can put your broom on the wall to take up less space. You also have things like bathroom light fixtures, door stoppers, and a bunch of other items. Now remember that you also always have the possibility to upsell. You can offer a cordless drill to help you install that new door handle that you just bought. Now in our eighth spot, we have consumer electronics. This is also something that once again is not going anywhere. Everyone needs to always replace either a charger or a USB. Maybe they lost their mini SD card. There's a lot of things that you can offer in this niche and the demand is always gonna be there. Also, technology is always improving. It's always getting better. Storage sizes are always getting bigger while the products themselves are getting smaller. And the average consumer is always gonna want the latest items. There's always gonna be new demand for products in this niche, as well as new items that are gonna be coming out. Some of those items can include portable Bluetooth speakers. Whenever there's a pool party or whenever there's an outside gathering, there's always gonna be music. And whenever there's music, people love wireless. That's where the Bluetooth speaker comes in. People also love selfie ring lights. The selfie craze is bigger than ever and so is vlogging. So when it comes to having the proper lighting, ring lights are a must. Another few products that you can offer are adjustable VR headsets, gaming headsets, portable chargers, storage drives, Again, the possibilities for this are endless. The number of items that there are out there are never ending. Next up, we have toys and baby products. Babies are being born every day. Kids are growing all the time and they're also letting go of their old toys and wanting new ones. Not to mention they're always breaking their old toys as well. Parents tend to focus a lot of time, energy, and especially money on their kids. So they're always finding new ways to be able to try to entertain them. Also, parents always want what's best for their kids. 
So always try to offer products that are age appropriate and safe and high quality. Now, some of the more popular items that you can offer in your store can include mobile rattles, the bubble lawnmowers, which kids absolutely love, glow in the dark stickers, baby thermometers, and the list goes on. Now, remember that when you are selling these items, especially for kids, you always want to make sure that you sell high quality items and avoid the items that could potentially be dangerous for kids and have little pieces and things that they can swallow. Now, in our number 10 spot, we have fitness and gym equipment. The awesome thing about this is that you can target two different demographics. You can target the people that go to the gym itself and the people that work out at home. People are always trying to be healthier, eat better, work out more. So this niche in particular is something that's always going to be in demand and there's always going to be a market for these types of products. One thing to note is that when it comes to targeting these two different demographics that I mentioned, the people that work out from home and the people that work out at the gym, the people that work out at home tend to have a higher budget. They tend to purchase higher ticket items a bit more because they actually need to purchase the equipment to be able to do these workouts at home. They could be purchasing things like a treadmill or a dumbbell set or even a bench. Now the people that work out at the gym are going to be purchasing items that are a bit different. They can be purchasing things like water jugs, bands, different types of workout apparel, things like that. Now a few things that can target both demographics can be things like jump ropes, resistance bands, water jugs, yoga mats, muscle massagers, and a few other things. Since people have been spending much more time at home, that has also increased the demand for outdoor products. So people have been wanting to step outside of their comfort zones, step outside of their house for a little bit to just escape the home office vibe and just have some fun outside. Which brings us to our number 11 spot, outdoor entertainment. Now this niche in particular is actually a bit tougher to get into. So one thing you really want to focus on when starting this, if you decide to get into it, is do a lot of research on your competition and see what's really trending out there and what's really selling. A lot of these products are used and abused. Since you're going to be using them outside, they're going to be going through some harsh conditions. So you always want to make sure you work with a reputable supplier that has high quality items. Now there's a lot of things that you can offer for this particular niche, but a few things that you can include can be a table tennis set, a volleyball net that you can put in your backyard. And one that really calls my attention because it just sounds like a lot of fun is a backyard zip lining set. Another thing is you have a huge potential to be able to upsell. You can offer things like a tent along with a sleeping bag and maybe even add on a water jug or something like that. In our number 12 spot, we have pet supplies. These days, people absolutely love their pets. Sometimes they love them even more than they love their own family. It's crazy. People go crazy over their pets and they have no problem in spoiling them. So you can rest assured that people are spending money on their pets. Whether it be a small lizard that fits in the palm of your hand or a huge dog that tries to act like a little puppy and sit on your lap, the different amount of pets that there are out there are endless, which makes the number of products that we can sell in our store endless as well. From a pet's habitat to their accessories and toys, the variety of products that we can sell are endless. And the best part is, a lot of the times people don't just have one pet, sometimes they have multiple. Some of the more popular pet items that you can offer in your store can include things like car seat covers or even sofa covers for dogs and cats, pet crates, chew toys, beds. There's a lot of different things that you can offer. So make sure you have a good variety so you can cater to all the different types of pets out there. Securing the number 13 spot is home security. Unfortunately, in the past few years, home security has become a very prevalent issue. Criminals are getting smarter, they're getting more sophisticated, and they're able to start figuring out new ways around certain security systems that we already have. Luckily, technology is always improving and so is home security. Having some of these items can help deter burglars or even record certain situations just in case. A few very popular items that you can offer are things like motion sensors, motion video cameras, night vision cameras, Wi-Fi security alarms. Just always make sure to consider the importance of home security and its growing necessity. Finally, in our number 14 spot, we have car accessories. People absolutely love their cars and they love putting their own personal touch to them so that way they can stand out. Now, the best part is that there's just so much that you can do to a car that there's a lot of products that you can offer. You you can offer products to spruce up the inside, the outside, make it sound better. There's a lot of things that you can do to a car. One thing that you can offer that is something that people absolutely love and at this point has become a necessity is a dash cam. They have a few different dash cams, some that we can record the front as well as the back. Another few things can be phone chargers, phone mounts, LED lights, 
and even a little garbage can that you can carry on your car to keep it clean. Now that we know the best products to offer in our dropshipping business, it's time to get to work. We have to start looking for the products that we wanna offer. We have to start looking for the suppliers and we probably wanna look for multiple suppliers. We have to start optimizing our titles, coming up with descriptions, taking pictures, downloading pictures from our suppliers' websites. There's a lot to do. Now, luckily we can save the headache of having to do all of that labor intensive and time consuming stuff. There are a few tools that can really automate the entire thing and just get us up and running in no time. Using an automation software like AutoDS can really save a lot of time when it comes to setting up our stores. It can turn weeks of work into days or maybe even hours. For example, one of the processes that AutoDS can streamline for us would be the product importing process. Whether you have one or multiple products, AutoDS makes it super simple. For example, one of the processes that AutoDS can streamline for us is the product import process. If we look on over at our AutoDS dashboard and click on add products, we can see here that we have the option to upload either a single product or multiple products. Let's go ahead and click on single product. And then from here, all you have to do is paste the URL. Another option that you have is go back to the added products and then hit multiple products. From here, you can enter multiple URLs or or you can upload using a CSV file. Another thing that you can get with AutoDS is complete and total order fulfillment. AutoDS will fulfill the entire time consuming process of ordering products and shipping them to your customer as well as providing them with the tracking. Now, if you wanna see the status of certain orders, that's super easy. All you have to do is go on your AutoDS dashboard, then head on over to the products tab. And there you can see the status of all the different orders that have come into your store. You can see that this one over here is pending. This one was already ordered from the supplier. This one was actually returned and these next ones have been shipped. Now on this Nomad lamp, it actually shows that the return has failed. Let's see why. If we hover over the little exclamation mark, you'll see that, oh, it failed because the return window's closed. As you can see, the AutoDS order details page is actually very detailed. Now let's check out their handy price and stock monitoring feature. For that, let's go over to the products tab. And once we click on there, you can see exactly how many your supplier has on hand. You can also see the price of the item and how much you're gonna be making in profit. Now, the cool thing about this is that AutoDS will monitor price fluctuations as well as stock fluctuations. So for example, if your supplier runs out of a certain product, it will automatically switch that stock to zero or sold out on your store. So that way nobody makes the purchase and doesn't receive the item. And it can also avoid the customer from having to go through a cancellation process where you have to explain to them that you don't have the item or whatever the reason may be. Now, one very unique feature to AutoDS is the price optimization feature. What this does is depending on how well or how bad the product is selling, it'll adjust the price accordingly. So if it's selling really well, it'll up the price by a little bit. And if it's not selling at all, then it'll lower the price a little bit to see if we can get some sales coming in. Another thing you have is very easy inventory management. You can manage all of your inventory from one screen. So if you click on over here where the products tab is, you're gonna see all of your inventory and a very handy feature within this is the ability to bulk edit. So you can select everything you want and you can edit everything at once. From here, after you click the bulk edit, you're gonna see this screen. Once you're here, just click add item to edit, and then you can edit any one of these options on all of the different products that you selected. So if you wanna add an additional profit to all of the items, let's say you wanna add one or $2 per sale, you could click this right here, add $2. And if you ever run out of items to sell or just don't have any good ideas of what to include into your store, you don't have to worry about that because AutoDS also offers a very handy product research tool. Using the product research tool, you can find highly popular and trending items in no time. Now, after you find those products, there's also a research spreadsheet that we offer that can help you optimize all of those listings. Now, if you want access to that spreadsheet, make sure to leave a comment down below requesting it and I'll be sure to link it for you. Now last, but certainly not least, is the Advanced AutoDS Image Editor. This really helps your listings and the images in your listings stand out from the competition. Using this editor, you can really optimize your listings by adding text, adding icons, drawing on the image, whatever you need to do, you can do using this image editor. Using all of these tools that AutoDS offers can really help you streamline the entire process of getting your store up and running. Having all that extra time on your hands can really help you start to scale your business even more or take some time off and spend it with the family. With that, we have reached the end of this video. If you found this information useful, if you found it all helpful and you wanna keep learning more about the dropshipping business, make sure to hit that subscribe button, make sure to leave a like. And once again, my name is Mario with AutoDS, wishing you all nothing but success in your dropshipping businesses. And I'll catch you all in the next video.